in North America, it's back to school time. I am so excited. It's, it's, the, it's all parents' best few weeks. The long faces of the children in the house as they face another school year. <laughs> it warms my heart. Today on Dottotech, I want to take a look at two apps that I think are real game changers in the education space. Steve Dotto here. How the heck are you doing this fine day? At Dotto Tech, we make technology easy so you can do more. Now, as I mentioned today on the show, it's all about back to school. And we're going to be taking a look at a couple of apps that I really like in the education space. Now, I have a very soft spot in my heart for teachers being married to one. And I think we all have a great appreciation for how hard teachers work for us. So the apps today are designed to make teachers' lives better that I'm going to be showing you. But before we do that, today's video is brought to you by Thinkific, which is our partner here at Dotto Tech that turns me into a teacher. We use Thinkific to deliver all of our online courses here at Dotto Tech. And when we first partnered with Thinkific, the capabilities of that system revolutionized our business. Now, if you want to learn how we use Thinkific to deliver both free and paid online courses, there'll be a link in the description below that will walk you through the entire process. Now let's get to today's video, which is all about teacher apps. I want to begin by talking about a tool called Remind. And Remind is a communication app that allows teachers to communicate with students and their parents, letting them know about all of the things that students and parents need to be reminded about. That Thursday is band practice, so remember to bring your trumpet to school. And on Friday, your project is due and this is your homework assignment, etc. Now here is the challenge that we face in this in the in our current social media and online world is all of the tools like Facebook and Twitter and texting on our smartphone all of these tools are wonderful for having instant access to communication but it is a challenge and a danger for teachers based on their privacy is make giving people access to their Facebook profile or to other forms of direct lines of communication puts teachers at risk in a variety of different ways. Uh, so finding a way for teachers to be able to use these tools to communicate effectively with their constituents, with both the parents and the students, but at the same time protecting the teacher's privacy is essential. That's, it's a real challenge. And the people at Remind have come up with what I think is a really creative and workable solution. So Remind is a service that teachers or school districts or schools can sign up for. And it's a both an online app and a mobile app that allows teachers to create a classroom environment that they can send text messages or email messages to parents and to students. And those, those students and parents can respond. But it's filtered through Remind so that the teacher's own personal information is protected. In other words, the teacher can send a text to you or I if we are the parents, and we can text back to the teacher. The teacher will get it as a text on their phone, but we won't know the teacher's phone number. It'll be put through a service, so we're just working through the app. I think it's a really creative solution that allows teachers, parents, students, administrators, all to have access to the, to the wonderful communication technology that the internet and mobility offers, but at the same time, protecting the privacy of all of the individuals involved, making sure that the appropriate level of communication is, 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 is used. Now, today in the show, uh, unlike my, our normal shows, I'm not really doing real hands-on demos because I'm not a teacher, I don't have a classroom, and I don't have the ability to, uh, to, to really demonstrate this technology at its, at its kind of highest level. Uh, but I will link to videos that have demos for both of the products that we're talking about today so you can view tutorials and uh, kind of deep dives into each of these applications. Now, the second app that I want to talk about is an app called Plickers. Now, with all of our different communication technology, a lot of companies are coming up with different quizzing and um, testing tools for the classroom. And some of them are hardware-based and fairly expensive, where teachers have apps on their computers or on their smartphones that allow them to ask questions, and kids have clickers that allow them to answer the questions, and then they can consolidate and combine all of the results uh, for these kind of instant quizzes. And the fact that it's a live interactive experience, it makes it far more engaging for students and teachers enjoy it as well. But 
that can be a fairly expensive solution, having all of this hardware, and then you've got to keep it all working. There has to be batteries and things have to be plugged in, and uh, there, there, there are a lot of issues around using hardware for this sort of, a, for this sort of an application. A brilliant tool called Plickers has come to the rescue. Plickers stands for paper clickers. And what happens here is students uh, basically have sheets of paper that have this kind of code thing on them that they turn and they rotate based on the answers. Now it's all structured around a quiz. So there's four answers that they can choose from. The teacher has an app that they run on their computer that they create the quizzes they use that app to project the quiz questions typically on the wall uh, using a projector. And then the students rotate the cards and hold them up based on A, B, C, or D as far as the answer. And then the teacher with their smartphone scans the room and Plickers automatically pulls all of these barcodes. These, they're like QR codes, really. Uh, pulls them all in, assigns them to the, to the student, and then consolidates the results. I think this is a stroke of genius as a tool. I know Shannon, my wife, loves using this app in her classroom. She, it's one of her absolute favorite things. She thinks it adds energy to the class. The kids all perk up when they get to do it. It's a fun, engaging way to quiz kids and see exactly how they're doing. And for the teacher, it becomes a real boon because it automatically consolidates all the marks of grading and seeing how well your class is understanding a certain topic. It's made that much easier. Two apps for the school that I think are real game changers. Remind, which protects your teacher's privacy at the same time allowing you, allowing them to communicate effectively with their entire class and parents, and Plickers, which is all about quizzing your students in an entertaining and educational way. What could be better? Now, if you found this video to be useful, entertaining, or enlightening, I have a few favors to ask. First is please make sure you share this video with others who may find it useful. And secondly, make sure you subscribe to this channel and ring that notification bell so you hear when we upload any new videos here at Dotto Tech. Till next time, I'm Steve Dotto. Have fun storming a castle.